the pressure of the water came in, it was so intense that the culvert did not, uh, was not big enough to support the pressure that was against it. Heavy rainfall and rushing water caused part of this road in Rodden, 60 kilometers north of Montreal, to completely collapse. This as parts of Quebec deal with flooding and several municipalities declared states of emergency as they evacuate residents. The water came through the culvert broke the road gave way it's the water, the pressure of the water actually the culvert is about three feet in diameter it happened on Monday evening this here yesterday I know a person one of my city councillors passed here probably half hour an hour before this caved in it's strange it's a nice lake where there's always beavers that flow into the river the fire department remains on high alert assisting residents in evacuations on a voluntary basis in St. Combe in the La Naudière region, many residents say they're having a hard time navigating as water floods the roads here. For the last 24 hours, it's a bit hard to travel by St. Combe because uh, the river kept flowing up. For Cameron Grant, a resident 10 kilometers away, he says his friends' homes are being affected. It's pretty sad some of them had to evacuate. Living by the river is pretty risky. A couple of years ago, it, it was high as well. And the road further up by the ski hill is completely, the 347, it's completely severed. So there's no traffic coming from uh, the next adjacent village. Down in Rodden, showers continue on with 15 to 35 millimeters expected through Wednesday, but the mayor says the water levels have peaked. Now it's this rainfall here. We're wondering what the effects are going to be. Uh, hopefully they won't be too dramatic and uh, things will stay under control. In the meantime, he urges caution. To be careful. If you don't have to go out, don't go out right now. If you do, drive slowly and uh, check what's going on around you. In Rodden, Quebec, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.